Hi guys, it's Tyra here with the Tone Aura. In today's video, follow along with me as I take a little trip to my hometown. It started off with me taking my nephews to the arcade. They loved it so much. They had so much fun and I actually had fun watching them play the games and win all the tickets and toys. It was just a really great time. After that, we met up with the rest of my family to go to this event called the Celebration of Cultures, where different groups of people come out to inform the community on their culture, what they eat, what they drink, and just their overall way of living. We stopped at the Mexico tent and grabbed us some street tacos. They were really good. Then we headed to Ghana's table to try out some, some of Ghana's drinks. The soap blow drink was really tasty and fruity, but the ginger drink was way too spicy for me, honey. I couldn't do it. My cousin Lakin and I tried some Indian samosas, and we ended it with some cold treats from Mexico with the infant miss tahini seasoning it was a great time seeing and hanging out with my family but i had to get back home with my wife honey and when i got there she surprised me with a spooky basket to kick off the month of october our entryway table came in the mail so babe started putting it together just in time for me to decorate and you know miss mama thinks she's the star of the show so she had to get her some camera time in as well while babe is putting up that entryway table i am about to start dinner we are just having some fried rice and some sesame chicken for dinner and I'm drinking this wine that babe brought me in my little spooky basket. And in my mimosa glass. In my mimosa glass. <laughs> I don't know why I got this glass. I am rushing on dinner because I have a tattoo appointment tonight. So I am going to get tatted up. Tatted up! I knew you was going to uh, sing along. I need a haircut. That's one other thing that I need to book. But yeah, I need a haircut. Like my hair is already going back. And you can barely see my little line design that I have. But oh well. So babe, put some chicken, I mean, put some rice in the pressure cooker. Try to. <laughs> Try to. And so I'm about to go ahead and cook this chicken and then get the fried rice going and then we'll be off. Babe is gonna go with me to my tattoo appointment if he allows like visit guests or whatever. And I will then be back to start decorating this entryway table. All right, y'all. So I'm finally done with the entryway table. Took roughly about 25 to 30 minutes to complete. Real simple three-step instructions. Looks pretty good. You like it, babe? I do like it. Yeah. Amazon got the best deals, y'all, so check it out. She got some items she's gonna um, place on there, so we'll see how it looks. And But overall, I think it looks good. Babe is putting up the mirror above the um, entryway. It's looking really good so far. And I'm going to start decorating it. I don't have everything that I want for the entryway, but I do have a couple pieces that I picked up at different times um, going shopping previously. And I'm going to see if it goes there. And then once I see that and see what I need, I'm going to go to Target, Home Goods, somewhere to get some more things for it. So I kind of showed y'all my tattoos. Babe recorded a little bit of me getting some of my tattoos. So yeah, I have this one. You can see it. You can see it better like that. This tattoo is just a rose and like a little silhouette of a woman's face. So I think it's upside down. You can kind of see it a little bit. <laughs> um, There it is. That's one tattoo. And then I have this one. And it says, love yourself. It's really cute or whatever. And this is um, an old tattoo that I've had for a while. Um, and then I got this cross on my wrist. And then the other one, let's see if I can show you all. I'm not gonna be able to show you. Let's put y'all on the floor so y'all can see it. Here is number four. It's just a honey pot. And I'm actually gonna get some words up there, but I didn't know what I wanted. Hi, mama. I didn't know what I wanted, so but I am get, I do know what I want now. So next time I go back, I'm going to get the words added above it. But it's just a little honey pot. It's really, I thought it was cute, and that's what I wanted to get. Hi, mommy girl. You saw the camera. You wanted to get in the camera. Um, but I do have some more tattoos that I want on mine. Not like a lot. Babe actually wants a tattoo, so maybe I'll book it the same day she gets hers. So I have a quote that I want to go here. 
um, then the words above the little honey pot. And then I have a shoulders hat that I want. It's gonna be from here to like here um, that I want to get. And then I also want something right here along this part of my arm, but this one is gonna wait. I'm not gonna get this one right now, but I definitely want to go ahead and get this, this, and that. And I will be done with tattoos for a while until I figure some more stuff out that I want. Today is a very chill day. We're not doing much. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna go entryway shopping today or I might go tomorrow. My family is, well, not my whole family, but my mom and my brother is coming into town this weekend. So I want to kind of just tidy up and clean up a little bit. Cause like I said, I can't do a dirty house. I mean, my house is never dirty, but um, I do want to kind of like dust and things like that. And I also want to get, I'm going to go to Walmart in just a few and I'm going to get some more light bulbs because our light bulbs are so like, I want the white lights and I just got dizzy cause I was looking at the lights. Um, but these are like the yellow lights, but I want the white LED lights. So I'm going to go to Walmart and get some and swap these out. So here is the entryway with the mirror. It looks really good. I like it a lot. Um, I do have a couple pieces that I have already that I'm going to put up on here, but I do want to get some baskets to put at the bottom. Um, and then my mom gave us a lamp that she had at her house that she wanted more than I'm going to see what it looks like up there and just some other little stuff that we have um, that I've gotten um, on some random trips to home goods and stuff like that. So I'm gonna see what that looks like. So I have this little trinket um, that I got from home goods. Then there's the lamp that my mom gave me. Um, I also have this um, vase that I got from home goods a while ago. watch a movie, play some music. At Walmart, I got the light bulbs, so I'm gonna get ready and change those out. Um, well, I'll probably do it tomorrow because I'm about to go ahead and cook. I feel like every time I get ready to record, I'm about to get ready and cook, but I literally be about to cook. Uh, we also went ahead and got some Halloween candy before they it's all gone because now that we're in like a little neighborhood, um, we will be participating in handing out candy for Halloween for little kids to go trick or treating. So we went ahead and got some candy tonight. And that's really it. We didn't really get much from Walmart. We just got a few little things like hangers and stuff that we know we were out of and we needed. And I also got some new face wash because ever since my face broke out with that hair, my face has not gotten back to what it needs to be. So stuff that I have been using, I just feel like it's not doing what it needs to do anymore. So I'm trying out something new. If it works, hopefully it does. I will stick with this. So I'm about to cook, I'm gonna turn this off because we're about to play music and I don't wanna get copyrighted. We also got our drinks and you're going to just sip on, I'm gonna sip on a little champagne. You're sipping on kettle one. Kettle one, I forgot. And peach, <laughs> and peach snap and cranberry juice, right? Yeah. Okay. So I might get some of that to sip champagne because mm -hmm. it tastes good. Yeah. Oh, or we didn't even do this. How to make a mimosa one on one. So you pour your champagne, pour the champagne to the rim, and then you get juice of your choice. I have um, I have cranberry juice right now. I also have some pineapple, but I'm gonna do this one first. And you do like that much. And that was really too much, but oh well. And you have your mimosa. Enjoy a drink. <laughs>
out of the um, bar lights. Um, this is the wider lights. Those are the yellow ones. So I'm going to turn the light on to see if you can see the difference. Yeah, so as you can see, this is what I wanted. I do not want the yellow lights. So I'm about to go in and change, swap those out to all, all of those to this light. And also the breakfast look light. I'm about to change those to the white ones as well. Here's the before of the breakfast look light. Very yellow, makes the house look very yellow. So I will show you all that. So here is the after. As you can see, it's much lighter. So I love that so much better, so much better. I also changed the dining room lights as well. I didn't get it before, but this is what the after looks like. That is it for today's video, you guys. If you enjoyed watching me decorate my entryway table, be sure to give a thumbs up below. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you won't miss any future videos. So with that being said, don't forget to light those candlesticks and give off that good aura.